I show over 12 cars Easter products in this video. Don't miss any of them. <laughs> this is another Mike Mozart cars review. Dead gum, it's Easter in Radiator Springs. Why, they even made a book called Mater and the Easter Buggy, celebrating Easter. Of course, we use nuts instead of eggs. And nuts look lots prettier. I have a question. Hey, Mater, in the human world, chickens lay eggs. Where do our nuts come from? Oh, shoot, Lightning McQueen. They come from robot chickens. Of course. Get her done, robot chicken. Here comes some now. I'm just teasing you, Lightning McQueen. It's the Easter Buggy that brings the nuts. For some reason, Mattel never made one of these little Easter buggy toys for this Easter. So I hand made one so we get an idea of what it probably will look like when they finally make it. For the love of Chrysler, look at all the toys they made for the book Mater Saves Christmas. They even made the Santa car. Don't you think Mattel should make an Easter buggy? That's right, Mattel, the same company bringing out these sweet hoverboards in a year and a half. Don't miss them. I bought three entirely different Easter baskets. They sell them at Walmart, Target, Toys R Us, Walgreens. They're all over the US. Here I am holding one in Walmart. That's the Cars 2 one available this year. And the other two filled baskets are for the first Cars movie and the Cars tunes. You will see the worst officially licensed Cars toy ever! <laughs> That's right, the officially licensed Cars stunt racetrack in the second Easter basket that I review has the most pitiful Lightning McQueen toy ever. The first Easter basket is all about Cars tunes and it's filled with licensed Cars goodies. And now let's open our Cars tune Easter basket. It comes with a gift card with Cannonball Mater the Greater. And now that the plastic wrapping is off the basket, let's see what's inside. The basket includes three different Cars Tunes candies that are attractively packaged but made in China. Let's taste test these candies and see if they taste good. Candy characters, what a creative name. Let's eat little mini Lightning McQueens and Maters. And what do these taste like? Chemicals. Now let's try our Mater the Greater Easter Jelly Beans from China. Nasty. And what do these lollipops taste like? Mmm. These are really delicious. There are graphics for lots of the Cars tunes. Mater the Greater, Tokyo Mater, and this mystery. Frightening McMean versus the Tormentor? They're a tag team! They're not supposed to be fighting each other. Daggum, the Tormentor isn't afraid of kicking your asphalt, Frightening McMean. Hey Mater, Tormentor, look who's coming! Easter, Easter! Why didn't Mike Mozart make a video of St. Paddy's Day products? Don't worry, Patty, we'll have a pint later and you'll forget all about it. We used Cars Tunes Power Punch Action Monster Truck Wrestling figures to demonstrate the move. Mike Mozart's gonna make a video about this matchup, don't miss it. They used miles of packing tape to hold the toys in these baskets. Yay! Mater, what is that blue number one foam thing supposed to be? Each one of these Easter baskets had a little skinny pack of Easter grass inside. Look, fun activities on the back for morons. Wow, Cars Tune Race Day activities. Who's that car? Wow, those are toughies. And there's a surprise once you pull out the cardboard backer. And the bottoms of these Easter baskets are really well constructed cardboard totes. Dead gum, they included a Rescue Squad Mater fire extinguisher. That's right, it's a blue foam fire extinguisher with a handle with a molded Lightning McQueen on the end. This sticker from Rescue Squad Mater is like the ugliest picture ever on a car's toy. And the handle of Lightning McQueen is horrifyingly bad. The stickers are way too big for the Lightning McQueen car. It's all stickers and his eyes are falling off. There's a sticker on the handle that says Toys by MTL, but these are made by Frankfurt Candies. And under the car is only a copyright notice for FCC, the Frankfurt Candy Company. We did test it with a bowl of water. It's freaking cold in Connecticut right now, and it worked pretty well. And also included is a Mater the Greater foam rocket that launches out of a cardboard tube. The graphics are really attractive on this cardboard tube. And the rocket launches pretty well too. And we kind of liked this toy. Daggum, it says right on the package not to aim it at the face or eyes. And there's an unidentified flying Mater saucer inside this basket, also by MTL Toys. You know this Frisbee's from Radiation Stinks because it glows in the dark. And all of the contents of this Easter basket will fit nicely into the tote base. And now let's open our Cars 2 Easter basket. I bought this one from Toys R Us. The Walmart one didn't include a water squirter. And now that the plastic wrapping is off the basket, let's see what's inside. This Cars 2 Easter basket is for ages four and up. I don't need to taste test these candies because they're identical to the ones that were in the Cars Tunes basket, just with different graphics. This is the Cars Easter basket that includes the stunt racetrack. I'll demonstrate it in just a moment. 
Of course they use way too much of that clear plastic tape on this basket too. And this basket includes race day sidewalk chalk, draw your own racetrack, and you know what? It worked really well. I drew my own Piston Cup racetrack and I drove one of my Lightning McQueens around it. Hey Mater, this is a toy I like. Now let's get a closer look at that car stunt racetrack that is so poorly made. Look at the directions on the back. It's a toy by MTL. There's no UPC code. It really seems like a knockoff that they found that they packaged as the real thing. It's always crap like this that becomes incredibly rare and valuable in the future. Now let's open that front blister card and look at all the pieces that come inside. This is a terrible representation of Lightning McQueen. At least the stickers fit the ugly vertical slab sides. There is no identification on the bottom of this toy at all. No country of origin, no manufacturer. We don't need that pesky Disney copyright notice. This is semi-Easter, it's quasi-Easter, it's the margarine of Easter. <laughs> Here I'm comparing it to a genuine Mattel Lightning McQueen on the right side. The quality is so poor, it looks like a knockoff. It's way too narrow, way too tall, way too cheaply made. The track snaps together pretty easy and the unique arrows cut into the track make it foolproof. The finish and molding quality on this track is deplorable. It's actually pretty easy to snap together the loop part of the track. And the two button key type launcher looks like a big blue tire. Gee Mater, I bet Mattel is really pissed tin cupped off that they made this toy. Dead gum, that launcher is very similar to the tip and race playset. You know the one with the cows that really tip over and go moo. That playset has one button key launchers to make the cars go. That's right, Mater, they both use a similar spring propulsion system. Lightning McQueen, are you talking to that there imposter? Mater, I'm calling Harv about this. Hey, Lightning McQueen, I see you're still going around in circle. No, Francesco, it's my imposter that's doing it. Get her done, Lightning McQueen imposter. Dead gum, I really like this slow motion effect. And the Cars 2 Easter basket includes a water squirter as well. And oddly enough, the stickers fit better. And the Cars 2 Easter basket has a flying disc of Lightning McQueen and Francesco Bernoulli. Oh look, fun activities on the back. Right. Ooh, race day activities. What could that secret word be? The base of the Cars 2 basket is also an attractive tote, which oddly enough has pictures on the inside as well as the outside. And everything that was in the box fits very neatly inside the tote. And now we'll open our third and last Cars Easter basket, one that's obviously based on the Cars first movie, and it has a huge backpack inside rather than a tote base. The backpack has exceptionally beautiful and colorful graphics and really is a great value for $19.99 in US dollars. The package is printed in color on the front and back sides and topped with a beautiful Piston Cup logo. And the beautiful Piston Cup graphic on the top is two-sided in color and perforated, so you can punch it out if you wish and hang it on your walls of decoration. It's really nice. You can clearly see on the back of the package, it's the arm straps that hold the backpack in. The very nice Cars water bottle fits beautifully in the little mesh pouch on the side of the backpack. I really like these Piston Cup poles. They're really nice. And they're made of quality die cast metal. There's one on the backpack itself and one on the small front pouch. And look how huge this backpack is. And the backpack is very deep and roomy. And this Cars backpack Easter basket includes a Mater Teeth lollipop made by Imaginings 3. Ew, I took the Mater Teeth out of the package and I took the plastic off the lollipop. I've got to put that in my mouth. Dag gum, you look handsome now, Mr. Mozart. Watermelon. And this Easter basket includes a pack of candy tires, which taste exactly like the terrible candy characters from the Cars Tune Basket. And the activity on the back of the package is ridiculous. It's color and cut out the characters. And because the cardboard is plastic coated, crayons and average art supplies won't work on them. You need permanent markers or it won't stick. But the match the characters game reveals that Ramon isn't married to Flo. He's been stringing her along for 40 years. And if you're in the USA, you could buy these Pillsbury ready to bake cookies that are Easter egg shaped of Lightning McQueen. And the results are less than wonderful and they really are not tasty cookies. But I thought I would show you a little bit of it. I'll make another longer video. Here are some spy camera shots I took in some stores to show you the new Cars products out. Now don't forget to rate this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to share this with your friends and check out all my other videos on the Toy Channel, Jeepers Media, and Toy Reviews on YouTube. Thanks again. In Target stores, there's a lot of Lightning McQueen Cars products. Look, a toilet seat. You can put your ass right against Lightning McQueen. And here are some bandages that you put on your hands, your boo-boos. 
They have a lot of leftover Valentine stuff, all marked 50 to 75% off. Here are some lollipop Valentines. Here are some Valentines with tattoos. They give them away in classrooms in the USA in Valentine's Day. And they have these little Valentine's ring pops that are lollipops with Lightning McQueen and the characters. Little chocolate hearts. Um, I guess he's fooling around on Sally. And the other departments are loaded with stuff here too. Here is a bubble blowing Lightning McQueen and the little bubble blowing shooter pops out of his ass. And this is what the cars department looks like in Target and it's pretty wiped out. They sell tons and tons of stuff in the USA in the Target stores. So the shelves are often empty in this department because the eBayers come and clean out all of the exclusives and scalp them on eBay. Here's an ugly little ride-on toy. Here are some little cheap plastic Lightning McQueen skates where the skates look like Lightning McQueen. You'll get killed on these probably. They look dangerous. And this really nice little plate here for only $2.99. Watch the ends of my videos. I'll give you little sneak peeks in the stores.